Hello everyone, welcome back to Miss Valley Gaming. My name is Dread. This is my Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough with Kestra Aylwood, the Dark Urge Bard. And her companions, some of them some of whom are wearing silly hats. Because it's my playthrough. The way I like to roll. Traitor. Refugees, adventurers, no one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met. And thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? They call me the goblin Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. Are you really locking down the grove? I know it's drastic, but more monsters seem to terrorize this region every day. What well, the people here? We druids will be safe. As for those that took refuge here, well, may Sylvanas guard them as they continue their travels. You just said the region's overrun by monsters. They won't survive by themselves. As I said, it's a drastic measure, but the survival of the Grove is paramount. That's They're just aren't enough me. supplies to support everyone. What are you selling? Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Take that. Take that. Give you some of this stuff. One loves of power. have enough gold, sir. Ring of Flinging. Thank you. 
Huh. All right. Guess that's about it. Sylvanas, guide your path. This grove is kept by Sylvanas's faithful. Don't mind if I do. We've known enough grief this ten-day traveller. Don't be the cause of more. We're exposed now. not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blazing spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. You should all stay. A single believe would make a difference. Oh, golly. Critical failure on that one. Roll again, yeah. There we go. Like, pay attention to what I said. Now, let me say it again. <laughs> Thank you. It's the right thing to do, and you know it. She's right, Roland. We're better than this. Zergen. Fine, I'll stay too. Lest you both end up with your throat slit by Goblin Blade. Thank you, Roland. We should have left by now. Damnation! Instead, we're just sitting here, practically begging to be attacked. Staying is a mistake. Run then, and run scared. Our best chance to make it to Baldur's Gate is on our own. This place is lost. Hold on, why are you so eager to reach the city? You are looking at Laroican's newest apprentice. Yes, that Laroican. The greatest wizard in Baldur's Gate. No idea. Uh, you sound excited? I've admired Laroican for years. Never dreamed he'd answer my letter. But I've worked myself to the bone for this. Few can match me in either magic or talent. The names Roland and Laroican will be known far and wide. Hmm. You'll see. I doubt that. Make me proud. This place is a bloody death trap, not a sanctuary. You should clear off while you can. It's getting to me. If we left, we could at least make a run for it. Go on. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. 
Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Good advice, child. You do well to listen. Hmm. You're on the right path, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends downward. And his thoughts become yours. You are the Blade of Frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. Okay. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. Yes, yeah, so and we both carry parasites. Mm. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid. Or so the stories go. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so... Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Shit! <sighs> you saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. What? She's an evil avocado? Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion oh. in the blood war between diabolical forces <laughs> and demons. Okay. Devil's advocate. You think she'll bring the blood war to Faerun? That ship sailed the sticks already. All I can hope for is to limit the damage. Her name is Carla. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. I'm looking to cure the infection to suggest we partner up. Just so you know, my first duty is Karlak. I'm oath-bound to go after her. But, I won't deny this infection is bothersome. I accept your invitation. Sorry, but there's no room for me. Uh, meet you at camp. A splendid plan. We'll talk more there. The waiting's getting to me. I saw you at the gates. You fight well. A few words for the kids. Spare a story or two. Oh boy. Soak the battlefield with blood. Do not resist death, but embrace it. Good job. Now they're even more scared. <laughs> Don't ask me to do these things. Oh man. And again. Swing and swing and just Hold out your hand, lady. Let me show you something. Go on. Take this ring. It's lucky. Call it. Heads or tails. Hey, hold on. You gotta pay for that. You didn't pay an experience. The ring is mine now. Fine. Keep it. Call it a sample, yeah? But you gotta at least look at the other rings, okay? I gotta eat. I don't have to do anything. Goodbye. You'll be sorry about this, scab. <laughs> Count on it. Oh, that was great. I enjoyed that. Uh, what was the ring, by the way? Oh, I got these glo gloves off the back. Yeah. Rimmed hat. The ring I picked up. 
magic ring. Yeah, it's, got, it's nothing. Piece of junk. A piece of junk. I'm ready. Whatever it takes. Still breathing, despite everything. Um, that. Here. Indolence breeds madness. Time to waste. Oh, action, not reaction. This is a nice weapon. I use this one. This is a three dash ten. A one dash nine. Two dash seven, one bludgeoning. All right, what now? Hey, check. Pave my path with corpses, build my castle with bones. Please, last room. By the way. Should do it. Send to camp. Send to camp. Let's do some leveling up here because I can. I want to level three now? Spell the beginning. Well, no. Uh -huh. Help. Nope, oh, something went wrong. What's going on? up something here. Shit. But basically I'm redoing this and I didn't want to redo that. Um I 
don't need that. Hey, what's it what's it doing here? Ink spell, yeah. There we go. Okay. So I thought I had the speak with animal spells before, which is why I clicked on the chipmunk. I was not expecting to kick it to death. But that was really friggin' entertaining. Um, before we go any further. My daughter, go right now! She's a thief, hell spawn, and you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Ragrashev, or I'll rip your damn throat out! <gasps> We need to get Arabella out, now! You heard the guards. They're waiting on Corker to give word. I'd sooner trek through the Nine Hells than trust that snake! Ugh. Uh, thought what happened. Why are the druids holding your daughter? Arabella tried to steal their idol. Druids lost their damn minds about it. They need it for their precious ritual. Oh, it's all my fault. I told her I wished the wretched thing would just disappear, or better yet, explode. Now Arabella's being judged by a bunch of druids who hate us. That's not right. Breaking into druid chambers to steal a sacred relic. Oh, she sounds like fun. Hmm. Eh. You try parenting her. And you should bugger off. Now! It seems like a good moment to talk. Carl Magrin, give her a chance. You, get back! Piss the fuck off. Or for me, you'd be overrun by goblins by now. I'd go where I please. Get back! Force my hand and I'll show you its claws. A moment. Giona. I just want to rip her down. Throw what? Out. Oh, I understand. You. Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. I'm going to remember you later, Chicky. I smell drama amongst these adventurers. What have you heard? Mm. Hey, Bolo. My good friend, you were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came, you saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Okay. No overstating my disinterest. I have no time for questions. I'll make it very quick. Hand to heart. Ask it. Glory. Now then. How would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities? You search your mind, successfully recalling various oh, details. Oh, I want a darker answer. Behavior. Didn't you see the tentacle ship? It was an illithid invasion force. The goblins are being controlled. Ye gods! Can it be? How terribly compelling. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? Dragons really have gauche. Witness declined to comment on nature 
Oh, dragon. Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the Absolute when they fell upon the gates? Yep, they called it like a war cry. They did, didn't they? Oh, oh curious. Oh, curious indeed. Get this off I've now. interrogated one. A captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! Yeah, Dradic has uh, Mag Maglubiute uh, responded. Oh, I'd imagine him quite displeased. Since their change in allegiance, these goblins are informed by a kind of strategy anathema to their kind. I, for one, intend to get to the bottom of it. I'm just preparing to head to their camp as we speak, in fact. If you'll excuse me, I ought not to dawdle. You were the one talking to me. Wait. What about our conversation earlier, the dragon? My friend, every story benefits from a dragon. Until we meet again. Would that we could speak freely, my Ursine friend. Alas, I've never learned to converse with your kind. Yes, yes, I'm quite aware. Other way, pig. Find our master. By Sylvanas, the forest father, we are granted balance. Only me. Understand? Where's my speak animals here? This one? Shh! I'm concentrating! Does this look good? Is the coin in the middle? Leave it out. It's too dull. Try again. It'll roll again. I want the coin. Dang it! See if a bird's getting the better of me. <laughs> it's not. And you better keep those fingers far away. Just a little bit, need to use the elevator. <sighs> okay. Super uninteresting. Okay. Keep their confidence if you insist. Complexum tu um abtera or tum ad nos defera. Okay. In umbram cretus. 
sanguine e dura tus. Rollsticker. Just a moment. This man is recording my story. I am far from home. As the colorful man starts scribbling, the bear sneaks a quick look at the page. His brow furrows. Incomprehensible squiggles surround a crude sketch. A bear disemboweling a clutch of tieflings. Come on. All the druids can understand me. You can. Why can't the man with the pen? I traveled a long way. The man nods thoughtfully and adds another dismembered limb to his sketch. Come on. All the druids can understand me. You can. I traveled. The man nods thoughtfully. All right, I'm not sure what we're supposed to do in this area. Would that we could speak freely, my Ursheim friend. Alas, I've never learned to converse with your kind. I have no idea. This is taking me out of the druids camp. I don't understand where I'm supposed to go. Oh, I gotta go over there. Okay, I need to be over here. Zoru, I gotta find Zoru. That's right. Actually, let's go up this path Can here. You tell me about this place. Is there anything up here? They are looking for a captive, too, remember? Damn it! Dance upon the stars tonight. Smile and pain will fade away. Words of mine will change. No. Become. Ugh. Words of mine will turn to ash. Words of mine will turn to ash when you call the last light down. Moon reminds me of your grace. Da -da -da. Repay. Rest and know that I will pray. Farewell, my dear old friend. Wait, that's it. Rock. You do a song now. Damn it. If I had known. If I had known. Thank you. I was having trouble uh, finding the words. All right. Yeah, just keep at it. It's been so long since I... Since... Sorry. Damn it. What's the matter? I haven't finished a song since Lihala died. I haven't played at all. I'm honest. Your pet goldfish? She was playing her lute. Oh. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. There was so much blood. Uh, I can still smell it. Range, I thought gnolls always come very loudly. Oh, I'm sorry. I had to say it. Oh, my God. I had to say it. I am so sorry. <laughs> eh. 
Hardly a unique tale of woe these days, tough enough or you won't last. You're right. She'd have said the same. The Weeping Dawn will be my gift to her. Thank you. I... I needed this. Too sweet. Odiously sweet. The vomitous gall within yep. despairs at your kindness. <laughs> Please, make it stop! Slow <laughs> down, what's wrong? Can't you hear it? Her singing. It's awful. Terrible. Oh, I'm gonna sing. Sing for them improve improvising lyrics. How can we stop this dreadful song half-formed worse from Devil's Tongue? Yes, yes! That's it! Finally! A song to set our heads straight after that display. We should leave before the effect wears off. Away! Away! Oh my goodness. Okay. Yeah, enough of the singing. Enough of the singing. Oh my word. No more singing. Show me again. Not now. We're working. Remember? Come on. Just once. Yeah, just once. Hey, okay, I am going. Something good here, I hope. eyes another one my friend's blood not enough come to rip me open too in Kresh Kalir a formal greeting begins with a bow <laughs> nice hat. Is this monster with you uh, you heard the woman bow <laughs> lower <laughs> Be serious, better get on your knees fast. You saw another gith. Where? On the road to Baldur's Gate, N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. The map. Show me. Mm. Up. You can keep your innards. That was hilarious. Oh, you're not going to eviscerate him. Oh. I was hoping for a show. Was it? Call your blood. I'll indulge you soon enough. Deliver me. Can't go that way. Why?
the locals prove compliant. A useful trait. Hmm. I warned you, didn't I? You ought to reconsider keeping her around before she causes real trouble. Eh. What comes next? The teethling was clear. If there are Githyanki west of here, that must be our objective. Purification cannot wait. Did you say teethling? I am unfamiliar with the, well, I shall not say culture, custom, perhaps. You will educate me on matters of this Fey run. I know, it's Fey run. What do you mean, purification? The Kresh holds the Zathisk. It will cleanse us of the parasite. By covenant, I can say no more. Is that everything? I think that's everything. Okay, everybody. That's it for this episode. Thank you for joining me here on Miss Valley Gaming on my Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, leave a comment and a like. Appreciate you all so much. We'll see you next time here in Baldur's Gate 3.